What's going on everyone? We are back with some more Sora Online on each blading and in this video we're going to be taking on the ultimate battle once more but this time we're going to be taking boss 2 of stage 2 and of course uh, he's a little bit more leveled up, level 125 over level 100 but what better way to uh, take this event on than to take on administrator level 120 fully built up with uh, what I would say the best equipment we can offer for her uh, obviously the sword could be better but that is her sword and what I did not notice last time was that it actually gives her 30% defense which is going to help her a lot um, in order to do the counters and save health. So uh, same team as last time as well so let's jump in and see exactly um, how good administrator is at level 120. So I do have uh, high hopes. Um, last time she was really good. Uh, she was taking like what, what, what was it one damage. Which obviously is going to take more than one damage here. Yeah, and the boss is more leveled up than us. So here, first things first, let's go into the the counter mode. And then uh, we got Leafa here who we got to go into enhanced mode. So let's go into enhanced mode with her. Um, let's pull out Asuna. And then uh, we're going to push him back. Perfect. And then we should be able to break him next turn. Alright, so this boss, so they did change it up a bit. I think this boss is actually weak to magic attackers now. Um, I'm gonna go assault, break, and then break link. So definitely, um, that, that is something that changed up. So it would be better to, to um, bring in a more magic based team. But I figured, you know. Might as well just see how much damage the administrator can do here. Because getting to that last boss is kind of tricky if you don't have uh, like enough of the armor and rings. Which I've been grinding lately. Alright, here uh, we're going to charge yell Leafa. So we can get our incarnate up for next turn. And then uh, something that would help us is to bring out Alice. So we do this. We push you back. And uh, this should be enough, right, to break him? Alright, so we do this. Flick Provoke. Um, let's do Assault here. Because if we do Charge, we would not be able to break him if we do Charge with the Leafa as well. It's 300,000? Okay. Uh, huh. Uh, Alright, doing really good numbers. Alright. So we're gonna go to 182. Another thing that I've been noticing about these bosses is now they break your incarnate more often than stage 1. So that's definitely gonna be an issue once we get stage 3. Because I can already imagine. Alright, so here our rotations got pretty messed up. So, uh,. We already got three bars on the recollection field. I think it's just better off we incarnate with administrator and see exactly how much damage can it do. Um, we're going to switch out Alice for Sinon. So do this, boom. All right, so time to see exactly how much damage administrator here can do now remember level 120 we got possibly the best equipment we can give her she's getting the 32% attack from the ring um, but he is resistant to physical attacks he's weaker to magic attacks so this might be about 400 mm -hmm. yeah 358,000 it would have been way more probably been like 450,000 if he was weak to physical attacks Which is interesting because that incarnate is not a uh, physical attack, but it is what it is. Okay, here um, we already got provoke. We might as well do more damage here. And then same with you. Same. Alright, he's already halfway. That's one thing that these bosses have. So that's one thing I've been noticing about these bosses too is that they don't have a lot of health. 
but what they do have is a lot of defense and a lot of attack power. So if you're able to like last a while, even if you're doing chip damage, you should potentially be able to beat these bosses if you don't run out of MP of course. So um, he's gonna break us here anyway so we might as well just uh, Might as well just do some damage, right? Because there's no point in charging, he's gonna break us. Unless I'm wrong. Oh, I was wrong, okay. But usually these bosses break every turn they attack, so... That's why I was saying that. So here, um... He doesn't have a lot of incarnate, so we can easily break him as well. So here, what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to bring Frizzell out. I'm going to give the break yell to the Sinon so that we don't have to focus about um potentially oh wait well if I do this well I want to see can we break him yes we will be able to break him okay so I'm gonna do this inflict provoke and um, get get the counters did it wear off? I think the buffs wore off, but we can buff after this. So we're gonna do this, boom. Maximize our damage here. Break them. Then we're going to assault. These characters are crazy. Um, another thing is that I waited to do this video uh, because they were doing a live stream today when the band is released to celebrate basically the New Year's and celebrate the the year of this game and all that and they did mention a lot of new things coming into the game specifically banners relating to um okay um do we need to heal no okay so let's bring you out here for the charge Re specifically relating banners to the to limited edition characters so it looks like we're gonna finally be able to see limited edition characters come back after um, what has it been like a year since they were released or announced in game and they said that they will come back in a special occasions I guess New Year's is more special than the anniversary okay but we get to see them come back but for okay so let me let me see we, sh we can kill them with an incarnate so let's charge our incarnate but so um, the downside about that is I think you can only get the tickets because they are ticket banners. I think you can only get the tickets if you uh, if you buy them, which is a bad thing. Obviously, um, they're gonna most likely be giving out like certain amount of tickets, maybe in the celebration or maybe in the future. But hopefully, uh, they don't stay like behind uh, paying. Because definitely uh, that's not, f that won't be fair for like other uh, free to play players out there who can't pull the characters and give them a chance to like, you know, get the characters. And I do believe it's only like a certain amount as well. Alright, so here uh, we're going to, I'm going to bring you out here, give buffs. And then we're going to also do this for more defensive and more attack buffs. So she's going to be hitting pretty hard, I would assume. Did her recast already work? So let's see. Uh, yeah, it did. So we can actually do the incarnate with administrator here. So yeah, let's try to see if we can actually finish it off here. 327,000 again. He's not putting bad damage. Like he's definitely very useful and I'm pretty sure he's dead here. So yeah, hopefully they bring out uh, the limitation character banners for like free, like they got free tickets as well to like at least get one or two of them for other players out there who may be looking for the, I believe they're only going to have like the first 10 or maybe first 8. I, I remember they saw, in the last room they showed off like the the basically the characters not the characters but they showed off like the names but it was in japanese so i can't really 
read it. I know there's like eight or ten names there, so so that's coming. So uh, that was uh, not that bad actually. So definitely um, this this boss right here is gonna be annoying. And just judging from how different in difficulty stage two versus stage one enemies were, I can already imagine how bad stage three enemies are gonna be. And uh, it's gonna be really interesting. So f for sure for that, I'm gonna use my better teams. I'm gonna have more equipment built up and all that. But that's going to be it, you guys. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Ground there, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. And uh, we're gonna be coming back to this event, clearing out stage three. Uh, first things first, we gotta clear out this boss. So I'll probably come back and do showcases on like the other EX characters. Um, I still need to do Sinons, I believe. We got Leafa from the second anniversary. We got a lot of good characters in recent times, so they're definitely gonna be helping out for this event. So I will be coming back here, but we did get the new characters as well. So I will be doing showcases on them as well in the ranking event. And there's just so much to do right now. So hopefully you stay tuned for all of that. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye everyone.